there are now 50 million tablets, 10 million of which are owned by people with kids in our target. This market will become five times bigger in the next five years, thus bringing our addressable market to 50 million users. There is a huge opportunity at the intersection of tablet computers and educators. We make the first news magazine for children on the iPad and uh, our mission is to create editorial products on touch screen that address both children and grown-ups. My name is Francesca Cavallo and I'm the creative director of Timbuktu Labs. Our first priority is to expand the market penetration of Timbuktu magazine. That will be our main marketing platform. By 2015, we will have 40 titles plus the magazine in six languages, addressing also the Asian market with a Chinese and a Japanese version. We will make money through a combination of paper book, advertising, subscriptions, distribution and licensing agreements. And Timbuktu magazine will be the main marketing and advertising platform for our other titles. My name is Elena Favilli, I'm the CEO of Timbuktu Labs and I'm the editor-in-chief of Timbuktu magazine. Timbuktu is the first news magazine for children, it brings uh, for the first time news also to the children market. Children are usually cut off from the world of news, but we think instead that what happens every day in the world really matters to them and that we need to find ways to uh, engage them in this story. We will distribute our titles on the, IT, on, on the App Store, on the Android markets, on Amazon and on Radio Children's channels. We create value through the creation and the distribution of the titles for kids and grown-ups to the proprietary platform that we'll develop for the magazine and by bringing for the first time the most advanced methods of education to the consumer market. But the core value of Timbuktu is its team. We have a profound knowledge of the customer and we have developed a unique approach to education, publishing and technology. And tablet computers can be a, a really great instrument to bring the most advanced methods of education to the consumer market. This is what we are doing. We started with the first news magazine for children specifically designed for the iPad. And we already have users in more than 50 countries and we started with an English version but we want to address um, new markets and new languages starting with the Japanese market in 2012. In the first issue of Timbuktu uh, there are illustrated reportage from India, uh, there is a cartoon explaining the difficulties that walruses have caused by global warming, uh, there are letters, plenty of illustrations, animation, photography and we really try to make a product that could be really enjoyed by uh, children and parents or children and educators. We have recently partnered with an amazing uh, educational institution which is Reggio Children and we're working with them to develop and distribute new titles. We want to create the next generation of educational publishing and we really want to use uh, technology as an instrument um, for imagination and for the discovery of the world.